Seattle. There you go, Mary. I was yes. looking for that reaction. Seattle proud Mary Lambert sang the hook on a Macklemore song that helped win the fight for same-sex marriage. A decade later, she's using her voice to help a whole new generation celebrate the power found in being different. Because of you, I think that different is the best thing someone can be. Arlo the Alligator Boy is an animated Netflix movie about a half-human, half-alligator, starring American Idol favorite Michael J. Woodard. There's not much that I don't have in common with Arlo the Alligator Boy. Mary plays a tough cookie turned true friend named Birdie. She's really vulnerable and sweet, and she has this kind of harsh exterior. Together, Birdie and Arlo set out in search of their destiny and befriend a band of outcasts along the way. A show of hands, who felt like a misfit at some point in their childhood? Okay. That's why this movie works, right? It's a fantasy film, but it feels very real to its stars. Our identities are becoming intertwined with our characters. Director Ryan Crago says when he was looking for a relentlessly optimistic actor to play his relentlessly optimistic lead character, Michael was the obvious choice. Um, I was just like, man, that there's someone out there that exists like that. <laughs> and Mary was at the perfect point in her life to get superhuman on screen. I started weightlifting. I felt real buff, and I was like, this is perfect for me. You know, I can love to train. The film is Mary's first acting role and a chance to break stereotypes. The script didn't have a single fat joke in it, and I think that was really important to heal that part of my identity that had always been the butt of the joke. She hopes Arlo and his friends can help make the world a little kinder, sort of the way that iconic song did back in 2012. She keeps me Mary, it's been almost 10 years since Same Love came out. It changed attitudes, it changed laws, it changed the world in a lot of ways. How did it change you? The amount of love that came from that release and that song was beyond anything I ever could have imagined. It had that that feeling of we're here at the right place at the right time saying the thing that needs to be said. She says she has that same feeling again with the very loving story of Arlo the Alligator Boy. It just feels so divine. Can't imagine the 